Hello, this is B.V. Ramana. Welcome to B.V. Ramana English Grammar. In this video, I would like to share with you the topic how to make the slow learners describe a bar diagram. Right, here is a bar diagram. The heading of the bar diagram is number of the students interested in different games in a university. Here, the question is how we can make our slow learners write a description about this diagram. It will be very easy. First of all, let us make the students write the introduction. In the introduction, there may be two sentences. First sentence is what is this diagram called? E diagram ni e mandamo dan ni first vakyanga raskundam. This is a bar diagram. What is this diagram called? This is a bar diagram will be the first sentence and second one what is this diagram about ee diagram then gurchi cheptundi ikkada manaki heading help chestundi aa heading ni teesukochi mana rendu vakyanga manam malchukochu so the diagram i mean it is about the number of the students interested in different games in a university here if you want to know what is this diagram about the heading helps us to write the second sentence so the second sentence says it is about the number of students interested in different games in a university. Right, a second pair of the description, we can make the students write the parts of the diagram. When you observe the diagram, we can find x axis, y axis and bars. So the same thing we can write as the second pair. It has bars. There are five bars. The bars show the different games. They are cricket, tennis, volleyball, golf, and basketball. Even then, the diagram of the parts ni parcelinchi. Mano runda paragraph ni mano pella chetha line chuchu. Right. As the third paragraph of the description, we can make the students write the values the diagram shows. Here, the number of students interested in cricket is 200. The number of students interested in tennis is 300. The number of students interested in volleyball is 400. The number of students interested in golf is 100. The number of students interested in basketball is 50. Like this, looking at the diagram, we can make the students write the values, the graph or diagram shows. So, diagram choose akrona values ni as it is ga or paragraph ka mano task coach. We can make the students write one more paragraph about the description by taking the comparisons among values. Taking the least and the highest value, they may write like this. Most of the students are interested in volleyball the least number of the students are interested in basketball and then by taking the differences among the values they can write like this the difference between the number of students interested in cricket and the number of students interested in volleyball is 200 like this taking many differences they can write many number of sentences as a part of conclusion the children may come out with their own opinions about the description one of the opinions may be like this. The most favorite game of the students in the university is volleyball. If we bring all the points together, we can have the paragraph like this. After removing the Subheadings, the final draft may appear like this. Let us take another example that is example 2. Here is the another bar diagram. The heading of the bar diagram is the number of bags sold in different shops in a town. Here the introduction will go like this. This is a bar diagram. It is about the heading will come here. It is about the number of bags sold in different shops in a town. Next, the parts of the diagram. 
it has bars it has five bars the bars show the different shafts they are shaft a shaft b shaft c shaft d and shaft e as third part of the description we can write the values the diagram shows the values are like this the number of bags sold in shop a is 200 the number of bags sold in shop b is 300 the number of bags sold in shop c is 400 the number of bags sold in shop d is 100 the number of bags sold in shop e is 50 like this as third paragraph we can make the students write the values the diagram shows then the children may come out with another paragraph of description by taking the comparisons among the values they may give the least number and the highest number like this most of the bags are sold in shop c the least number of bags are sold in shop e and also they come out with another paragraph by taking the differences among the values like this the difference between the number of bags sold in shop c and the number of bags sold in shop a is 200 like this taking the number of differences among the values the children may come out with number of sentences and as a part of conclusion they may give their opinion like this the most favorite shop of the people for the bags in the town is shop c if all the parts of the descriptions are brought together it may appear like this in this way we can make the students write descriptions about the bar diagrams i hope you feel that this video is very useful if you think so please subscribe to my channel tapping subscribe button on youtube thank you very much for watching namaste